here it's just so free and fun and people really embrace performance and and it's it you know Toronto's a little more staid in that way it's a little more stiff but I think they've found now with just for last 42 the format that works in Toronto breaking it down to smaller clubs here there's like gigantic galas and and there's always Montreal and, and Quebec it, of course has got a more festive kind of persona and party and they embrace this stuff in a way and I think in Toronto people would be embarrassed or a little bit uncomfortable with that kind of putting on funny costumes and miming and blah, you know that it's there's a kind of a disdain for that and it doesn't I'm, I have to say I'm not a huge fan of stilt walkers and stuff but it gives a whole atmosphere that you know is is so in interesting so if you had any advice for a comic just starting out or an aspiring comedian be they an improviser or a writer or a stand-up uh, what would that be you know you can tell people about material you can tell people about whatever but I think the one thing that's important is to do every show you can do it get on stage all the time and the only way you find your voice and your persona is by doing the work and work hard you know don't be lazy don't talk about working work